So what is the value of coaching, especially monetary value? This is a question that pops up in the minds of anyone who is looking for a coach and wants to determine how much should I pay to a coach. This is also a question that is in the minds of coaches when they want to make a quotation to a prospective client. They are not clear about the value that their coaching adds to the client and therefore what is the value or what is the money they can charge in return for their services. So here's a perspective on that. Value you get out of this process is proportional to a number of factors. Let's try to understand this with the metaphor of your gym membership. If you take a gym membership, you pay a certain fee and that is the cost you have to give in order to get access to your gym facilities and the trainer. If you do not go to the gym at all, then the value you get out of your investment is zero. If you go to the gym, but you are only exercising mildly, you are spending a lot of time taking photographs and whatever else, or maybe talking to people, then you will get a small value out of it. However, if you visit the gym regularly, you exercise consistently, you are maxing out on your physical capabilities during those exercises, you do it for a period of time, and then you will see tremendous results in your physical health. So if you are asked a question as to what is the value of gym membership, you will say, oh, it gave me tremendous value because the value you got out of it was in proportion to the value you gave to that engagement and how much you put in of yourself. Same is the case with coaching. Now, if a client comes to the coaching session, they have a great discussion, the client gets some clarity and maybe they even decide on something that they are going to do. But after that, they forget about the coaching session until it's time to book the next session. And then they will come to the second session saying that the coaching hasn't worked for me at all. It hasn't been effective for me at all. Well, you can imagine where I'm going with this. They did not get any value because they did not put in any of their effort in the process. Now, on the other hand, if you come to a coaching session, with full sincerity, you take your notes, you come to a clear conclusion by the end of the session as to what is the new perspective you have gained or what is the action item you are taking away for yourself. You agree with your coach on your measure of success, your accountability partner, and a number of other details, and then you follow up on that. Then you are going to get tremendous results. You are going to come to the next session not only with more things to discuss, but you will also have your own experience to share with the coach as to how it went. You know, whatever you had decided in your previous session, was it successful, not successful? What did you learn about yourself during this period, through this, etc. So the more you put in your time, your effort, your commitment to the coaching process, the greater is the value that you will get out of it. The coach obviously has to play a big role in this process, but that role has its limitations. The client also has the responsibility of bringing in topics which are far reaching, which are deep, which are really meaningful to them. Sometimes I have seen that clients bring up trivial matters because the organization has assigned them a coach and they're not that much interested in it and they will bring up something trivial like, uh, you know what, I'm watching too much YouTube these days, so what should I do to reduce it kind of things. So the result that they're getting out of that session is also limited to the kind of problem they brought forward. On the other hand, there could be a colleague of theirs who is talking to their coach about, you know, I have just been given this big team and I'm having serious issues with such and such team member and this is what just happened. I don't know what to do when there is a big project coming up next week. Now, if they bring up something serious like this and they come to some kind of a clarity by the end of the session, then imagine the impact that that one hour of coaching conversation will have on their work and on their team going forward. If you want to get full value out of your investment in coaching, please show up to the sessions consistently with full sincerity. Be 100% present during your coaching session take down notes, come to a clear conclusion for yourself, and then most importantly, follow up 
on whatever you have decided, whatever you have agreed upon with your coach. And then you will see that you are going to get amazing value out of coaching. And if you are a coach watching this, then please convey this spirit to your clients. Whenever they are negotiating with you on the cost of your coaching services. Thank you.